Um, I know you you've, yeah, I'm good. Uh, listen, I know you've been pretty down since your accident. Yeah. You know, I wanted to play football so bad I could taste it. And maybe go on to the playoffs or... Yeah, I know. I, I understand this appointment. I really do. Yeah? Yeah. Now, I personally think that you have a bright future ahead of you. And I'm not just talking about the fleeting glory of sports. What do you mean? I'll give you a clue. You're a natural born leader. You're one of the most popular students at Carver. You're honest, you're straightforward, and you don't crack under pressure. Thanks. We all saw that amazing fourth quarter against Westside. That was amazing. <laughs> all the kids look up to you. Now, what does that spell? I'm gonna be for class. Student Council President Paul. What? Me? I don't know anything about that stuff. But Miss M, that's Tracy's thing. She always works so hard at it. She's a Sheesh. real She's a real go-getter, Paul. Yeah. And she's really nice. Yeah. Yeah, but don't you think that one person assured a victory kind of uh, undermines the whole idea of democracy? But Miss M, there's Tracy I mean, and she That would be more like a, a dictatorship, like we studied. Miss M. Paul, what's your favorite fruit? My favorite fruit? Mm-hmm. Pears. Pears. Good. Okay. So, um, let's just No, no, just no, no, no. No, wait. Apples. 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 Fine. So let's just say, uh, all you ever knew were apples. Apples, apples, and more apples. You might think, hey, apples are pretty good. Even if you get a rotten one every now and then. But then one day, oh, there's this orange. And now you have a decision. Do I want the apple or do I want the orange? That's democracy. I also like bananas. Oh, I gotta go. I'm gonna be late for class, alright? Okay. I'll talk to you. Well, what do you say, Paul? Time I give a little sum back? Yeah, yeah.